passiert. Game Day. Ein Schwäbischau. Die Schwäbischer Unicorn schlagen Samsung Frankfurt Universe in einem extrem aufregenden Footballspiel. Und jetzt geht's hier gleich weiter mit Sascha Wander. Look at these puppies, aren't these nice? These are our rings from the 2017 season. A lot of hard work went into these rings, a lot of good memories, and I made a whole freaking movie on us trying to get these rings. Very special. Uh, today is our first game of the 2019 season. We play an exhibition practice game against a GFL 2 team from the North, Solingen, and afterward we have a ring ceremony and we're getting our rings from the 2018 season. Very special. Today should be a good day. Our song, man. We got it? We ready? We're ready. Are you ready? So Cody and I have this tradition of listening to this German rap song by Beginner on the drive to every unicorn's home game. It's a strong tradition. We're very superstitious. Year four. Year six. Year six. My golden year, baby. Tradition. Year six, we're in the six. Let's go. Man, year 36, we're in three six. Optima Sport Park, we get there, see some of the guys. It's crazy to think this is my fourth season with the Unicorns. This time is going by so fast. How we feeling, little man? Ray, you excited? He's looking sweet, Jim. Hey, what's up, dude? How you doing, sir? Sir? Oh, guys, we are hour and 40 minutes to kick off. No matter how many football games I've played, no how many years I've played, I always, always get nervous before games. And I love it. I think it's time to put the camera away, lock in. We'll see you guys after the game. After the game, we had this little ceremony to get our uh, new rings for the 2018 German Bowl Championship that we won last year and we gave out some awards to some guys uh, which was cool to see some guys get some recognition who really deserved it and then we got these awesome awesome rings here check this out Beautiful, it's absolutely beautiful. But these rings are cool because they symbolize all the hard work and teamwork and dedication and pain and suffering that goes into the season and to have a little physical token that will represent it forever is pretty cool. So the game was good. It was a good practice game for us, uh, Test Spiel. Uh, we won 40 to three against Solingen. Um, I feel very confident about our squad this year. For me personally, it was a little bit disappointing because I have this reoccurring lower leg injury that keeps coming up and keeps kind of holding me back. And so that acted up again in the game. And now I've probably hit a little bit of a setback, which is super, super frustrating. This kind of what are you talking about? I can't play. I'm gonna play. Listen, I'm ready to play. What I want. Yeah, it's super frustrating because football is an extremely important emotional outlet for me and I always get a little bit or feel a little bit off when I don't get to play. And so if I have something that holds me out, it always messes with me. I'm hurt, dog. Don't ask me if I'm all right. Hell no. But what's actually helped me right now is this book that I'm reading. 
today, Junior? Somebody sent me this last year, and I, I don't remember who it was, but whoever you are, thank you so much. This book has been the most life-changing book I've ever read in my life so far. Um, but anyway, one of the main themes in the book is a person can't always control what happens to them, but what you can always, always 100% control is how you respond to what happens to you. So I can't necessarily control what happens with my body injury-wise, and you know, I get really, really frustrated when things like this happen, and sometimes I find myself getting into a pattern of negative thinking and frustration. Oh, my life! So I'm trying to apply these themes to my situation right now um, and not let the frustration or negative thinking take over and instead, you know, just be like, all right, this is the situation, this is what you're dealing with right now, how are you gonna respond? And dealing with it in a positive manner because that is what you can control. But it ain't about how hard you hit, it's about how hard you can get hit and keep moving forward, how much you can take and keep moving forward. So I'm working on that. It's something I need to get better at. You can't always control your circumstances, but you can control how you respond to those circumstances. All right, guys, and uh, our first home game, April 27th at Optima Sport Park in Schrebisch Hall. See you there.